Well, it is now the month of August, and this is usually when we start to see the uh, increase in the, the amount of tropical activity come the Atlantic and the Caribbean. And so three spots we usually watch out for when it comes to tropical development in the month of August is usually right around the Gulf of Mexico is one of the number one spots. Number two would be in the Southern Caribbean here, uh, usually right off of the Yucatan Peninsula or even around uh, Jamaica, Cuba. And then the other area to watch is out in the Atlantic, of course, usually in the central southern half of the Atlantic. Uh, and a lot of these are the ones that can typically sometimes ride along the East Coast and that's what we really watch out for here along the eastern seaboard. So uh, there are some stuff that we are watching right now. Uh, right now, the biggest one uh, or the best chance of any development is uh, what we're calling Invest 97L right now. And this is a 90% chance of becoming a tropical system, uh, a named tropical system within the next uh, 48 hours or so. So uh, we'll keep an eye on that, but it's still very far away and it'll be days upon days until we can really get a, a, a good track on that one. So. Uh, just to show you where we are in terms of the hurricane activity, we're starting the climb here uh, in the month of August. So now we're really starting to see the increase in tropical development. And usually the peak of hurricane season is right around September 10th, September 11th. And so uh, we got quite a while until we are really at peak, uh, but it just goes to show you that there's a lot to watch over the coming weeks. Working for you, I'm 20 Storm Team Meteorologist Chris Bazakis.